On the Celtics announced today that Kyrie oh, Irving will under, get it, needy, undergo uh, a oh, minimal invasive today. procedure to alleviate irritation in his left ankle tomorrow. Uh, the timetable for his return to the floor will be given after the procedure takes place. So, I mean, here's here's a question. Mm -hmm. uh, Kyrie needing this procedure uh -huh. uh, in the, so late in the season, should people be concerned? Is it something, nothing, or everything? I mean, it, it's definitely <laughs> something. It might be everything depending on how long he's out. It's a minor procedure, but as the saying goes, it's always minor when it's not my knee, right? <laughs> if it's someone else's knee, it's minor. But the idea is that he's had this knee yeah. and rest has not made it better. So now they have to take the next level up and get it scoped to try to clean it out. Why did it take so long for them to figure out that rest hasn't made it better? Well, I mean, I think you got to give rest a chance. The, the first priority is always to not go under the knife, right? Is try to see if we can do this through rest. But obviously that didn't work, so now they got to go under the knife. And we are approaching the playoffs less than a month now. Yeah. Yeah, which is why to me is everything. Yeah. Because was, yeah. anytime you have less than 15, 20 games and you're talking about your star number one player, your all star, mm -hmm. having this kind of procedure this late, there's got to be recovery time. And he hasn't been playing, so that means yeah. that his cardio is not where it needs to be. Sure. I'm not saying they're getting bounced in the first round. I'm saying they may end up working harder in the first round than they didn't need to. And that could have problems for the second. Down the event. line. Exactly. Yeah. All right. Uh, so this next topic, I feel is there's. No need for it, but um, uh, we'll get to We're going to mention UCLA every day, so, so <laughs> you got to get some UCLA talk right here.